So, Internet of Things, what it is, that's a good question. I don't know if anybody does have an answer, but that's any single object that could be connected through whatever mean to Internet. That means that on the other side of the object, there is somebody uh, which is looking at what this object is doing, uh, getting a different type of data, and doing some proper actions. So it could go from uh, monitoring the eggs in your fridge up to monitoring and to have a connected car. While Internet of Things could be the overall hat of all what is all the objects that are connected. And machine to machine could be a subset of the Internet of Things. Uh, but well, there are, there are so many different uh, opinions, different uh, definition of what could be or what is Internet of Things or as Cisco was saying, Internet of Everything. So, um, which vertical we are seeing more uh, attractive or with a lot of potential or the more mature, uh, mature vertical segments? Well, if Gemalto, we are, we are relying on, a, uh, on our assets. So we are coming from the uh, telecom environment, from the GSM, from smart card provider and wireless module as well. So we are addressing the IoT through the GSM part, while IoT could be, uh, it could be connected by any single other means than GSM. So if we take the M2M part of the IoT, the main segment we see growing with a, a lot of growth potential are, of course, automotive, so OEMs, the connected car, and the future of connected car, so vehicle to vehicle communication as well uh, in, in the future. So that's the, 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 the big market segment. Then you've got all what is related with remote maintenance and control. You can control and maintain whatever assets there is uh, on the field, again, as an egg in a fridge up to a pipeline in the, in the countryside. And the third one, which is really, okay, today it's extremely fragmented and uh, not a lot of volumes uh, as such, but very gross potential is definitely mobile health. Mobile health and e-health, where you have assisted living, chronic disease, but as well uh, comfort uh, applications. So through your mobile phone, you can check uh, every single day, and every single minute, uh, how fast your, your heart is beating and how much calorie you are, uh, you are uh, spending. So what is the role of security in the Internet of Things? That, that's a good question. Um, again, starting with our core assets, so uh, dealing with secure transaction, securing the transaction, the data, guaranteeing the privacy of personal data. Moving from M2M to the big IoT, uh, security issues and security risks are even further, even bigger. Because today, we, in machine to machine, we are in a control environment, closed garden, an automotive stay in the hand of the automotive maker and the automotive maker is dealing with all the key elements of the car. While if you look at Internet of Things in the house, for example, home automation, you've got a hub somewhere which is giving all those data outside and you're going to have provided by a different service provider application provider, small devices, sophisticated or not, that are uh, getting uh, information on your electricity, uh, information of your washing machine, yeah. on the, the, the greenhouse you've got in your garden to figuring out how much water you want to distribute or not. So you're opening a closed garden to many different service providers. So the more you open a system, the more risks there are. So one of the challenges in IoT will be how to monetize it, how to make it mass market and profitable for all the stakeholders involved in those machinery, let's say like that. So having uh, the right guy accessing to the right data and not damaging the overall infrastructure is the main challenge in security in IoT. And that's why security will start with the risk evaluation of the overall system and the possible open doors that are left in this infrastructure. And that's 
we start to jam out to expertise by evaluation of the infrastructure and then of course we've got plenty of different tools, hardware, software, embedded software and services to accompany our customer to secure more when necessary their infrastructure.